Bard was first released to public users on March 21, but failed to garner the attention or acclaim won by OpenAI's ChatGPT and Microsoft's Bing chatbot. In some tests of these systems, Bard was consistently less useful than its rivals. Like all general-purpose chatbots, it is able to respond to a wide range of questions, but its answers are generally less fluent and imaginative and fail to draw on reliable data sources. However, Google CEO Sundar Pichai has responded to criticism of Bard, promising that Google will be upgrading the chatbot soon. In an interview on the New York Times Hard Fork podcast, Pichai said, We clearly have more capable models. Pretty soon, perhaps as this podcast goes live, we will be upgrading Bard to some of our more capable Pong models, which will bring more capabilities, be it in reasoning, coding, it can answer maths questions better. So, you will see progress over the course of next week. POM, or the pre-training with contrastive learning of language models, is a more recent language model developed by Google. It is larger in scale and more capable when dealing with tasks like common sense reasoning and coding problems. Pichai noted that BARD is currently running on a lightweight and efficient version of an AI language model called Lambda, which focuses on delivering dialogue. In some ways, I feel like we took a souped-up Civic and put it in a race with more powerful cars, said Pichai. Pichai also discussed concerns about the fast-moving development of AI and potential threats to society. Many in the AI and tech communities have been warning about the dangerous race dynamic currently in play between companies including OpenAI, Microsoft, and Google. Earlier this week, an open letter signed by Elon Musk and top AI researchers called for a six-month pause on the development of these AI systems. In this area, I think it's important to hear concerns, said Pichai regarding the open letter calling for the pause. And I think there is merit to be concerned about it. This is going to need a lot of debate. No one knows all the answers, no one company can get it right. He also said that AI is too important an area not to regulate, but suggested it was better to simply apply regulations in existing industries than create new laws to tackle AI specifically. Despite the potential threats posed by AI, optimism about its potential remains within Google, as indicated by Sundar Pichai. It is clear to him that these systems will be very capable, and the possibility of an AI system causing disinformation at scale is acknowledged. The question of whether it is AGI or not is deemed irrelevant, and the importance of anticipating and evolving to meet the challenges of AI safety is emphasized.